Hello everybody and welcome back to Space Astronomy. My name is Wolfhard and if my voice sounds a little bit off it's because I'm a little bit sick. But that's not going to deter me because I need to get videos out. Um, so today we're going to be making this basic solar panel so we can get moving on with getting into space. So to make it we need to make a bunch of different things. I've been working on some stuff. Do we have any left? Yes, we have some. Um, I've been working on trying to get a bunch of steel so I could make stuff. That's not what I wanted you to do. That's what I wanted you to do. I need some coal. Uh, cool. So that's going to get to work. Uh, we do have some steel in here. We need one of these basic wafers. So to make it, I believe we first need to make this because we're going to need one of those. And then we need to make this guy. A full solar panel. Which is why I have a ton of aluminum wires. So to make these blue solar cells, we need to do this fun stuff in a circuit cap fabricator, which we conveniently have right here. Um, so it was two silicon lapis up here, redstone, and diamond. Alright, that's working. Also, we're getting down on diamonds, so I may need to make some more. I can make one more right now. There we go. Now we have an extra diamond. I'm gonna have to go collect some more Mimikite after this. Hopefully we have everything we need. Alright, got nine blue solar cells. Now for that, after that we need to do that. That and that. Yeah, and we need six of them. Now what's the next step? Let's make this guy. Six of them with wires in the middle. Okay. So we got six and wires. Now for this guy, we need that. We need wires, pole, wafer, <laughs> and compressed steel. Man, this, this is going to sound like a very weird video. I usually don't do any recording when I'm not feeling good. Ah, uh, so we got our solar panel. Hey, we get some leaves. I think we already have some leaves. Oh. Sending cargo supplies. Ah. <sighs> now we have 128 oak leaves. Wonderful. <laughs> This is so much stuff. <laughs> Disposable item turret. The turret will need to be placed on the turret base, and the turret base will require power and ammo, such as blocks. Cobblestone can work. I can get millions of blocks of cobblestone pretty easily. Uh, what's the other one? Sending cargo supplies. Cargo loader, unloader, launch controller, and fuel loader. <laughs> and that gives us a filled, 10 filled fuel canisters. Okay. That's a lot of steel. Oh my gosh. This thing is so slow at making steel. There's an advanced one that you can make from immersive engineering. Let me... Immerse... Immersive engineering. There's a book you can make in here that details how to make the next one. Where are you at? Book, 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 book. Engineer's manual. That's not what I wanted. I want to know how to actually make it. Engineer's manual. Book and a lever. Okay. I think we can make that. Do we have any leather? We do not have any leather. <sighs> Luckily, we don't have to deal with mobs all that much. Let's dump some inventory. We're going to look into... I was hoping to look into just doing some... Some little bit of work stuff around. And maybe get into expanding the base. Because we need some more room. We're getting into more stuff. 
and it's not really we don't really have a lot of room to work with and I think what we're gonna have to do is a room above the blast furnace and coke oven is gonna have to expand where the cows you can see I've been collecting wool in here I think the cows are this way and am I right yeah they're there just need one one leather Come back here. Stop that. Gotcha. Didn't even give me a leather. There we go, we got our leather. Ah, I hate being sick. Forced me out of going to work today. Not like I'm really hating it, but I do like the money. Uh never noticed that one water block. I think I did that. Either way, hopefully I'll be back to normal tomorrow, next day. Exit should sound fine because that's pre-recorded. That that one I kind of record as I go. Uh, this one I tend to set up stuff and then record it, so it won't sound too ridiculous. I need a lever. I need a stick. I have one stick. I need a cobblestone. We have 11 cobblestone in here. There we go. Now we have a book and a lever. Gives us an engineer's manual. Okay. Yay. Uh, construction. No. Simple machines. I don't know where it is. Blast furnace. Uh, I do like how they give you a convenient little diagram to show you how to make these things. Improved blast furnace. Oh my gosh. You gotta make that stuff in a reinforced blast brick. Not only does it allow the automation of in and outputs, it can also be outfitted with preheaters to speed up the refinement process by addition of hot air. Ugh. Made from reinforced bricks, so you'd be advised to spend your first batches of steel on this upgrade. But it can do it with iron, too. How do I make this refined iron plate? I don't know. So it looks like it's just a 3x3x3 three by three by three like the other one was. It's just tall. It's just the same thing. And one hopper. <sighs> and there's a preheater. Oh my gosh, you need so much stuff. Preheaters are used to heat up air and then blow it into the furnace to speed up the refinement process of iron. Each furnace can have up to two preheaters connected to the ports on each side. And each preheater requires 32 RF to operate. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so complicated. At least we can make it in the same place we have this one. Just gotta re reposition that guy. To some, my corner's missing. Oh, that's because I was supposed to put a granite up here. Whatever. It's a very slow at making steel. I think I'll work on doing that next time. Today, I really want to get into some of this other stuff and some of some like the NASA workbench. But we're gonna need a, its own room really to do that stuff. But we can work on creating it. Display screens. Okay, let's let's see if we can craft this. Four steel crafting table. Easy enough. 
Do we have a crafting table? Some sticks to make some levers. And make the redstone torch and holding the steel and we need one of these guys. Let's get our one redstone. Okay, we got those. Got our torch. Got our levers. So let's that. That. Nah. Yes! We got an ass workbench. Let's put this thing down and look at it. Oh my god, you're huge. <laughs> so you're gonna have to go in the middle of a room. Oh my god. So we got four display screens. <coughs> Man, this is the way I sounded earlier was much worse than this. Uh, let's see, getting fuel, oil buckets. Like two buckets of oil. Okay, I can do that. I think I have one bucket over here somewhere. By the way, sorry if I sound like I'm breathing on that thing. It's just because of how I have to talk. Uh, display screens, buckets. For most of our resources, by the way, we're also going to be heading into this mining world just because it has everything we need. It's got water, it's got oil, it's got the quarry, it's got sheep, chicken, uh, pigs, cows, whatever you need, reeds. Eventually we might set up a, a, uh, like a farm in here. Now there's... Well, this way. All the animals on the map kind of covered up. Here we are. Okay, we got two buckets of oil. What else? Craft a refinery. That's not the refinery I know. There's another one you can make. This one. Which I think is a little bit easier. Let's compress steel, copper canisters, which are a bunch of copper. Whereas this one is, okay, no, this one's not easier. A couple of tanks, some diamonds. Still don't know how to get these black diamonds. So I guess they're on another planet. Carbon nano hoops. Okay, we're going to make... The one they want us to make then. Oh my gosh, the other one is expensive. But that place is, uh, that mining world is a great place to go for resources. Wow. Also, we have not looked at this in a while. Maybe we'll go check to see how much stuff he has. Uh, yeah, we got two more. Oh, you're at a cool cook. You have not. What? Hmm. Oh, I have half a stack in here. Yo. Uh, what are we doing? Making that thing when he had copper. It was two stone and a furnace. Do we have any furnaces in here? No. Reactor casings. Stone. Uh, we have enough cobblestone to make a furnace. And we got the four right next to us, but we're using those. 
furnace, some stone, steel, and these guys. Power required 1200. Jeez. Dig an input of oil and energy and output fuel used for rockets and vehicles. Vehicles. So, put you here. This thing can hold a lot. 24 buckets. Wow. Battery. Oh, so you can turn it on and off. Okay. Let's go ahead and hook that up. We're going to look in here. Fill a canister with fuel. Empty canister. Compressed tin. We have compressed tin. We have that. That's iron. Tin. So that was... We need a tin can. Do we have any in here? Yeah, one. Okay. Tin can. Compressed tin. Compressed steel and glass. What am I doing with that? There we go. I can put. It. Wait, what? Fluid transposer. Great. Refinery. Oh, I just feel like that. Refine. Yes, each one of those takes two buckets. No, it takes one. Alright, whatever. How you doing? Going down. So let's... Increase, decrease it a little bit and... Oh jeez, go, still going down. Such a finicky thing. There we go, we're going up. I don't know if I like that. It doesn't hurt us. Come on, hurry up. And there we go. Next step craft fuel loader. Ah. <sighs> Still gotta make these things. Compressed aluminum, wafer, five compressed steel. Don't have enough compressed steel. Dang it! Well, give us that. And it was ten. That's lead. Am I out of ten? There's my ten. Where's the rest of it? I think I used the rest of it up. I'm gonna have to go collecting. Uh, go resource collecting again. Let's see what was it? This, 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 
this, that, and there. Fuel loader. McDoodle8.com. What? Space program guidance. Yeah. Okay, we got five filled fuel canisters from that. Wonderful. Building the tier one rocket. Yes, we're getting there. Uh, was it this one? We can actually say we have one of these already. And building the tier one rocket. What does it take? Tier one rocket. Oh my gosh. Nose cone, these heavy duty plates. I need so much steel. It's gonna be ridiculous. Ugh, I should wear a hat again. Ugh. So it makes two at least. That's one, two, three, four, five and a half. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, and thirteen and a half. Fourteen, fifteen and a half. We need freaking full stack of steel. Oh my gosh. Uh, we'll be working at this for a while. <laughs> so I got all these filled fuel canisters. That we're not going to use anytime soon. Fuel loader. What are these display screens for? That's super complicated. What are these? Rocket launch pads. And it gives you 10 of them. NASA workbench will help us make it. If we go over here and we look at this stuff. Launch controller. I have a feeling we're going to need that anyways. Dash. Don't have any dash. What about this guy? Compressed steel. Hopper. Aluminum. I think I just need to collect a ton of steel. Yeah. I just need to collect a ton of steel. <laughs> ah, man. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to convert this guy into a blast, the the industrial blast furnace off camera, since there's really not much of anything to it apparently. Just who was it? improved steel plate. Uh, metal plates. I need an engineer's hammer. We have that. Okay. Or in a metal press. Constant. Whatever. I'm going to work on doing this off camera. Uh, today's going to be a bit of a short day because, yeah, we need a lot of resources for next time. We got this NASA workbench made. This huge conglom conglomerated mess. <coughs> Sorry about the way I sound. Like I said, I'm a bit sick. I've been sick since last night. And yeah, it's not fun. So that's it for this time, guys. If you like to hit the like button below. If not, let me know what you don't like in the comments. And I will see you guys next time. Oh, hi. Where are you? Carbonite Gap Gar. They do drop something, I think. I think you can scroll through.